Hey guys, I know it's been a bit since a video upload here, so I'm going to do something that I've been playing with for almost a year and a half now. Got this lovely Kershaw here, as you can tell it's it's been used, it's definitely shown some signs of wear. I uh, carry this every day, <clears throat> use it for all my wiring and other tool needs here. Um, Things have been pretty nice. This is not a sponsored video. Kershaw did not ask me to review this. Uh, I actually bought this while I was working. And uh, the only problem I have ever had with this is over here. This bit driver. Now, originally, I don't know if it's... Well, it's not welded, but it's, it's like press-fitted in. And uh, I had a brake on me. I tried pushing it on. It worked all right for a little while. A couple of torques on some big nasty screws and popped it off again. Stuck it on with some Gorilla Glue. It's been like that about a year. Uh, Kershaw will replace it if you do break it. Um, on the other hand, a little measuring tool on there. I've never used it for measuring, really. Um, <clears throat> this thing comes with two flat blade and two Phillips bits. You can also take any set of bits that you have, put in your necessary bit. You can also swap it out for one of those if you don't happen to use one of those all the time. You have something else, maybe you, say for example, need your, your T25. You got one of these sets, swap it out, not a problem. Square bits, uh, you know, anything that fits into Standard bit driver goes right in there. Never had any of those fall out. They stay in there pretty nice. Uh, almost totally operated one handed. These are spring loaded, they flop back in. Doesn't matter the position. Yeah, goes right back in. Not a problem. Knife on here is not bad. Uh, it is locking lever. You can use both your screwdriver and your knife bit at the same time. You do have to remove the bit from there to get it to fold in. Just like that. Um, the lock's pretty good. It's definitely springy. Uh, the original factory edge that's on the knife, as you can see, it's definitely been abused. Yeah, it's been beat up a little bit, scratched. Even broke the tip off of it once. But, still works. Here again, Kershaw would replace it, but I'd rather just beat it up. Mm. It's a nice knife. Like I said, use it all the time. Carry it every day. Um, never had any problems with the screws coming loose or anything. I've taken it apart one time to clean it. Just absolutely packed with stuff. As you can see, it's kind of getting some junk in there. Even while that happens. Still works. Still functions. Holds an edge pretty well. Um, I don't use it all in the manners prescribed as you would typically a knife. When I'm at work, I pull staples out with it, the big copper kind that are like, you know, an inch and a quarter or whatever. Um, pull them out of boxes, pull 12, 13 of those at a time. Never had a problem. And uh, otherwise, if you're looking for a good knife with some tool properties, this thing's pretty badass. Um, as I said, I've been carrying it about a year and a half to two years. And uh, occasionally I sharpen it with just a little Harbor Freight knife sharpener, you know, kind of slide it through. I think I got it sitting over here. Yeah, just that. Yeah, put it in, draw it through. That's it. Um... But if you're looking for a knife with some tool capability, this thing works out pretty well. As I drop it. Drop test. No. Uh, part of the reason I haven't posted anything in a while, guys, I have moved out of my house. <laughs> Currently living with somebody else and all of my stuff's packed in here. Yeah. Um channel's probably going to take a slightly different direction, hopefully get some more videos out to you guys. Um, but uh, 
just uh, actually purchased something today which you guys will see here in a later video definitely fits with where the channel is going um, I'm gonna try working on a few things getting some things back in order but uh, yeah as I said life's been a little hectic recently guys so reviews have been slacking um, of course we've got COVID and everything else going on here but uh, anyway guys good knife once again it's not paid um, yeah so hopefully here uh, you guys will see some more stuff coming at you and uh, I'll do my best to get this channel going keep things on the road keep it all camping outdoors related um, yeah you guys will see what's what's going on here shortly but uh, anyway guys stay safe enjoy and uh, if you get the chance pick up one of these knives i don't remember exactly what i paid for it but uh in two years it's definitely been worth it anyway guys have fun bye